It's the biggest opioid drug bust in Alberta's history. Not just removing fentanyl from the streets, but the chemicals that could have produced hundreds of millions of street doses. This will have an impact on the supply chain in Alberta and all of Canada. They're calling it a super lab. Alert sharing these images from a rural property near Alderside, part of a provincial network of trafficking, able to produce 10 kilograms of fentanyl a week, finding an estimated $300 million worth of finished product. Keeping in mind that a fatal dose of fentanyl is consistently recognized at two milligrams. One kilogram of fentanyl has the potential of creating one million doses at the street level. Or as we view it, 500,000 lethal doses. But with the network now cut off, questions around what will happen to those addicted to street opioids. Ultimately with our, our folks that are, are using, we want to get them into uh, ultimately detox treatment and recovery. Recently, BC announced they were beginning to work on a safe supply network where under doctor supervision, someone with an addiction could get a prescription to remove any dependency on illegal and untested street drugs. Could Alberta follow suit? won't be uh, going down that road. Trying to make sure that there is a uh, recovery-oriented system of care that's going to help those who are most vulnerable. With charges pending against key suspects behind the network, police will also be analyzing these guns to see if they can link them to any other crime in Alberta. In Edmonton, Carly Robinson, City News.